We are counting down to today's eclipse. Millions of people will be looking up when the total eclipse passes overhead. So we've all heard those warnings, don't stare into the sun, but just what is the danger? How real is it? Joining us now is Dr. Janet Tui. She's a comprehensive ophthalmologist at Kaiser Permanente in Santa Clara. Good morning, thank you for being here. So can you really go blind by looking at a solar eclipse? What's the real? Um, yes, it is possible. So staring at any prolonged, for any prolonged period of time, intense light can cause permanent changes to the retina, which is the tissue that lines the back of the eye. And when that happens, we call it solar retinopathy. Uh, many people think of blindness as being living you know, in complete darkness, but blindness can also mean not being able to see fine details or loss of sun vision. And that's the kind of blindness we're talking about when we say staring at the sun or a solar eclipse can cause blindness. Uh, if you've ever been to um, an ophthalmologist or an optometrist's office, you may remember them asking you to read that big E at the top of the eye chart. And, um, you know, imagine if you couldn't read that big E um, or anything smaller or couldn't see the details of the face of the person in front of you. Um, that's what can happen. Mm. Um, so, you know, affected patients might start noticing this within the first few hours of uh, the damage. Um, but we can see changes in the retina that can progress for days after the event. Uh, some patients can get better over the next six months, but many patients will still have permanent changes in their vision. Let's talk about those flimsy little glasses. Do they expire? And what about other types of eclipse viewers? Is it safe to drive during the solar eclipse? Yeah, those are good questions. Um, as long as the glasses meet the International Organization for Scanization, ISO 12312-2, requirements and they're not damaged, meaning they're not torn, they're not scratched, they don't have holes in them, um, you can use them. Um, they don't expire. Um, there are some older models out there that may have um, an expiration date that says like a warning, don't use if it's uh, been past three years. Um, and that's because it was thought that some of those materials could degrade over time. And so you should follow those warnings. Um, remember, you wanna see that you know ISO 123 one, two dash two um, printing on the side of glasses. Okay. You can also, yeah, you can also see if they're legit by checking the American Ast Astronomical Society's uh, list of reputable vendors. All um, right. And that label, yeah. Dr. Jen Chui, thank you again so much this morning. And we hope you get a chance in your busy schedule to go out and look up. <laughs>